You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, Bold and Beautiful fans. This is Soap Dirt on YouTube, and we want to talk about some of Hope Logan's history that directly and factually contradicts dialogue that we are hearing right now on the CBS soap opera. Namely, I'm talking about Wyatt and Liam talking about how Hope would never, never cheat on Liam. That's not how she is. That's not the kind of person she is. She would never, never be unfaithful. Well, you know, it's funny that Hope and is the subject of this talk between Wyatt and Liam because in fact, she's cheated on both of them with the other brother. Do you remember this? We're gonna dig in to Hope's background of infidelity on b and in just a second. If you haven't already, reach down, click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our Bold and the Beautiful casting updates, spoilers, and all the news you need to know about your favorite CBS soap opera. So let's dig into this. Starting back when Kim Matula played the role, there there was definitely Hope Logan cheating instances. For instance, when Liam Spencer back in 2013 was married to Steffi, Hope kissed him. So she was cheating with Liam when he was with Steffi, even though she wasn't the person in the relationship, she was still enabling his cheating. That still makes her a cheater. So that was one thing. And then Steffi and Liam broke up and he wound up with Hope. That was also in 2013. She and Liam then got engaged, and then she was kissing Wyatt behind Liam's back. So there's all these situations where she's kind of gotten away with stuff, and she hasn't gotten busted. In one instance, after Hope saw Liam talking to Steffi, not making out with Steffi, not touching Steffi, not fondling Steffi, not even flirting with Steffi, and she took off with Wyatt to Hawaii and married him. And then at one point, Hope was actually dating Liam and Wyatt at the same time because she couldn't decide between them and was waffling back and forth between them. She also, if you remember, she got married to Wyatt because Liam didn't show up to their wedding at the Eiffel Tower in Paris, and that was because Quinn knocked Ivy Forrester into the water, and Liam ran late to the wedding, and so she, you know, ran off with Wyatt. Then, while married to Wyatt, she had an emotional affair with Liam and was going to leave Wyatt and get back with him, only she found out she was pregnant with Wyatt's child. Of course, she later had a miscarriage, but still. So that's all this, like, Wyatt and Liam cheating stuff, and then her cheating with Liam while he was married to Steffi. Well, that's all facts, facts about Hope being a cheater, being a proven cheater, being a cheater where you can go back and look at old clips and see her cheating. And yet, Wyatt and Liam were having this conversation this week on Bold and the Beautiful about, oh, it's so great that Hope is not like Brooke. She would never, ever be unfaithful. She would never cheat on you. And they have completely written this in their minds, Wyatt and Liam, that if something happens between Hope and Thomas, well, it must be Thomas Forster's doing because Hope would never do that. Well, they both know that Hope would do that. What the writers seem to forget is that fans remember past plots and when they say things like this, which are blatantly out of context and in complete contradiction with known history on the soap opera, it's a huge problem when they they just decide to, I don't know, treat fans like they're ignorant and they haven't been watching for years. It's kind of insulting. And it's also, it's just rewriting the character. And this kind of retcon is just sloppy. So then Kim Matula left the show. Hope had gone off and was like in Milan. I think she was working for some international thing over there. And then they recast with Anna Noel and they brought her back. It was around 2018. And the cheating resumed. While Liam was with Steffi and while she was pregnant with his baby, Hope kissed Liam. And this was while Bill was basically lying to everybody and trying to convince them that he and Steffi were in a relationship. She kept telling Liam to just leave Steffi. And then he was still engaged to Steffi when 
Hope got pregnant with him. And you can't blame that all on Liam. And again, Hope wasn't in a relationship at that time, but Liam was. And he got frisky with her at Forrester Creations and she got pregnant. And it it was just awful because he was still with Steffi. I think that was at the time where Steffi might have just given birth to Kelly Spencer. At any rate, it was just very messy. And she knew that Liam and Steffi were going through a rough patch. And that was because Liam had an emotional affair with Sally Spectra, if you remember. Member, and that's what upset Steffi and had her spend that one night with Bill. So it's Liam's cheating that is another part of this factor, but he is choosing to forget in this very messy dialogue they have written that Hope very much has engaged in plenty of unfaithfulness. So if you remember when she got pregnant, when he was engaged to Steffi, then Steffi did something that had fans really cheering. She pulled the engagement ring off her finger, slid it onto Hope's finger, and basically proposed to her on behalf of Liam and was like, you take him. You take him. Go ahead. Steffi stepped out of that and luckily for her, she found Finn, and now it's Hope having to deal with this situation, and Liam should know better. The bottom line is, he does know better, but he's so sanctimonious. Granted, I don't think she's cheated as much as Liam has, because he is engaged in both physical affairs and emotional affairs, and he likes to get involved with women that aren't his wife. He is a known waffle boy, but Hope Logan when Kim Matula was in the role, was Waffle Girl in a way because she ping pong back and forth between Wyatt and Liam Spencer. So her hands are not clean. And so this dialogue is real frustrating for people that have been watching this a while. And in a way, her behaviors are very similar to her mother, Brooke Logan's, because Brooke would get involved with men when they were involved with someone else, like Bill with Katie, like Ridge with Taylor. Brooke was right in there cheating with them and enabling their cheating on their partners. So when they try to say, oh, Hope's not like Brooke, well, well, you know, maybe she held on to her virginity longer and she wasn't modeling lingerie in Brooke's bedroom. But in a lot of ways, her behavior already is a lot like Brooke's. No, she's not the slut of the valley like Stephanie Forrester liked to call her mom, but her hands aren't clean. And so this dialogue is very frustrating. Liam should know better is the bottom line. If you haven't already, reach down, click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our casting news, spoilers, and everything you need to know about Bold and the Beautiful. And and share in the comments with us, do you remember Hope's history of cheating? Even if she wasn't in a relationship at the time, if she's making out with Liam when he's with Steffi, that's still cheating. So you have to consider all that. The stuff she did with both the brothers, the her managing to get pregnant while he was with Steffi. There's just a whole lot of stuff there. And so let us know if you are finding this dialogue frustrating and this retroactive rewrite of her character frustrating or if maybe you see hope that way too, but history doesn't lie. They can try and rewrite it, but it is what it is. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. 